Hello and welcome to the channel. My name is Vijay and I am a Microsoft MVP specialized in SharePoint. In this video, we are going to see how we can remove SharePoint online site collection administrator uh, by using browser, by using PowerShell as well as by using PNP PowerShell. So basically, uh, when we are talking about uh, the site collection administrators, there was things when we were talking about site collections. But nowadays, uh, when uh, the modern team site, it's all about just site and instead of the administrator this concept of the owners so we'll see those things so uh, we will check uh, basically how we can remove uh, the site collection administrator or the site administrator or the owner from uh, classic sharepoint site modern sharepoint site how we can do this from office 365 admin center and then uh, how we can uh, uh, do this using powershell basically by using the sharepoint online management cell and then how we can use through PNP PowerShell. So let me open uh, my SharePoint site. Okay, if you are interested for SharePoint training, I have some SharePoint training courses for developers and uh, then for the site owners as well. It has also an index power platform, uh, SharePoint framework training, SharePoint development training, or you can just check out for the entire training course bundle. I'll put the link in the SharePoint in this uh, video description. Now, uh, just first we will see how we can uh, remove from the SharePoint site, uh, which is a classic site. So if you will see here, this is a classic SharePoint site and you can click on the settings icon, then site settings. And then if you will see here under users and permission, you have the site collection administrator. So you can use this option to add or remove site collection administrators. So you can put by a separate uh, separate by the semicolon. And if you want to remove anyone, just click on the cross and then you can click on OK and the user would be removed. So this is how we can remove uh, from a classic SharePoint site. Similarly, if you want to do from a modern team site. So here is a modern team site which you can uh, which we can use. Uh, uh, for or which uh, this is basically a modern team site. So if you want to remove the uh, site collection administrators, uh, there is the approach that you can remove as a site owner. For example, if you will click on this uh, settings icon or the gear icon, then you can see here SharePoint permission. Click on this and then you expand the site owner and here you will be able to see the site owners who are there um, uh, for this uh, owner of this particular site collection or the site and then click on this uh, um, uh, this this one name and then if you can see here who are the group members here but if you will go to the members tab you will be able to see based on the role so if you'll see here this user is a site owner either you can change as a member or if you want to remove you can uh, remove the user from the group so uh, the user will be removed and he will know uh, he or she will not no more be a member or a owner of this particular uh, group now apart from that also we can uh, um, or we can go to sharepoint uh, site i'm um, sorry sharepoint online admin center and from there also you can uh, uh, you can uh, uh, remove a site owner or a site collection administrator now if you will go here uh, on this i can see here i will just go to the admin page just put hyphen here admin and you will come up with the SharePoint online admin center. I'm using the modern admin center and you can see here site and then active sites. You'll be able to see all your sites here. So you can see here all the sites uh, you can you'll be able to see this consist of your modern team site communication site or any kind of site that you have created. You can see here there's a classic site or this modern site anything you can uh, you can see here and then you can just click on this and uh, once you click on then there is permission tab is there where you will be able to see the uh, owners or the uh, all your uh, owners who are uh, group owners and also the members you will be able to see and uh, if you will click on this manage then here you will be able to see all your administrators so you can just click on this and then the user will be removed or the owner will be removed and then just click on save down here in the button now we will see how we can uh, remove the user from sharepoint uh, site 
by using PowerShell. So make sure that you have installed SharePoint online management cell. I'll put the link in uh, in the video description. You can have a uh, go through on that. And then once you have installed SharePoint online management cell, then you can run the commands over here. And uh, I will use uh, PowerShell IAC uh, basically. And uh, here uh, click on search on Windows PowerShell IAC and then it will open this. And uh, now we will see the command. So I'll let me just copy the commands here. And uh, if you'll see here, now this this is to connect to the SharePoint site, basically to SharePoint online environment. So in this case, you need to provide the SharePoint admin center URL, and then it will ask you for the credential. And the second uh, uh, command you can see here, we are retrieving the current site, and then uh, you can set uh, the user as, uh, or you can remove the access as the admin by using set hyphen spo user command you can see here it will take the site url login name and then each site collection admin to false you can make this or you can remove the user also from the site so you can also directly remove it so i'll just uh, remove uh, these commands and if i will show you uh, if I will go to the site collection administrator, you can see here the user is administrator now. So I'll go here. I will run the command. I will put my credential here. Dot on Microsoft. Dot com, and uh, I'll put my password here. And once you put the password, then it will on the second command will execute, and uh, you can see here it is successfully executed. If I'll go to say a site collection administrator, which you can see here only the user is there, the other user Bhavna is not there. So you can use uh, this uh, commands also. Apart from that, also we can use the PNP uh, PowerShell command. PNP nowadays a lot of companies are using, a lot of professionals are using this. So, but make sure that you have to install the uh, PNP module. And once you install this, then you will be able to run the commands here. So this is uh, very easy to uh, remove the admin permission. So let me just copy this uh, credentials, sorry, the command from here. So now you will see here, uh, now there is a first command connect hyphen pnp on, online so it will take the url and the credentials uh, make sure you have access to this particular site in this case to connect to uh, to sharepoint online you don't need to enter the sharepoint uh, admin center url you can directly put the site url and then the command here you can see here remove hyphen pnp site collection admin uh, and it will remove the owner from here so uh, so this is basically will remove from the modern team site. You can see here, this is SPFX training is a modern team site. So this is how you can remove uh, the site collection administrator from SharePoint online sites. And if you like our videos, kindly subscribe to the channel. Uh, you will get a lot of free videos on SPFX, PowerShell, uh, Azure, SharePoint, and uh, Power BI, Power Apps, all these Microsoft Microsoft technologies videos you will get. And then these are our website, enjoysharepoint.com, sharepointsky.com. Do visit, and this, this is our Twitter handles and LinkedIn and Facebook pages. So do like us and uh, subscribe to the YouTube channel. And also I'll put the article URL you can also go through from the video description. Thank you and have a nice day.